Mr. Bealen? Uh, no, no, I'm sorry, he's not. Can I help? I'm just returning Bobby's laptop. There's nothing unduly concerning on it. Unduly? I can't go into details, but given that he voluntarily handed it over and he's been cooperative, perhaps we can just keep in touch. Monitor the situation, make sure he's doing okay. If you could get him to call the number on the card, it'd be much appreciated. So he's not in any trouble then? Not at present, no. Thanks for your time. the police. Bob was in the clear. He's done nothing wrong at all. Well, look, did you hear what I said? It's all been a misunderstanding. Yeah. You can go and get him. Go over there now, apologise and bring him home. It's not going to happen. I don't want him around no more. My son. Everyone's on their side. You can tell. I mean, look! Look at the way they're staring at me! Look, let's get out of the cold and have a nice cup of tea, okay? I don't want to impose. Will you get in? I'm free to my watch it's off out here. Come on. Better keep our voices down. Ian's upstairs. In bed. Not well. Something like that. He had a falling out with Bobby. In fact, he's thrown him out the ants. Oh, why can't people just be happy? Well, if I knew the answer to that, I'd still be in the Mick. I had to grant with the house full of kids. <laughs> Instead of me and Mick. <sighs> I went to a meeting. You know, a, a, a meeting for alcoholics. Well, that's brilliant. Yeah, yeah, it was all right. Scary, you know. Yeah, yeah. And then I come back, I got straight back on the booze. Not without good reason. Listen to me, Linda. I'm about to give birth. I've not packed my bag for the hospital. I've not even done a list. Because all I can think about is winning back my son. And I don't want that for you, Linda. What do you mean? Well, you say that social services are onto you. Mick's had enough. It's not impossible you could lose Ollie. <laughs> Look, I'm not trying to scare you, OK? Just be realistic about it. You need to get it together. I can't. They're scheming behind my back. Are they? Are they really? Or are you just being paranoid? Do you really want to end up like my mum and dad? Hmm? Him serving their divorce papers Christmas Day. And all because of the booze. I mean, look, this is what they used to be, happy. Do you really want to make the same mistake with Mick? Now, every couple that runs the Vic, every marriage, it hits the rocks. Me, Mum and Dad, you know, me and Grant, Cat and Alfie, it's a long list. Right, look here, the backstocks, first landlords of the Vic. You drowned her in the bath. Mm. <laughs> Stop, Stop Ali. <laughs> Linda, you are strong. Now go over there and talk to him. You can sort this out. 